What's up? What's up, guys? Let's have a look at BTC today. How's everybody doing? Hope your day's going good, your evening, your morning, wherever you are in this world. Hopefully, it's going good for you, man. Little look at BTC here. Uh, $1.25 trillion market cap up 3.8% right now, 63.5 at the time of recording. Uh, looking kind of good. A little bit of a recovery, guys. Some people talking about it going down to, uh, you know, 55k 52 53k we'll see we'll see some people think it's going straight up we got tech dev talking about uh $140,000 btc by the end of july so we'll see what happens right we'll see what happens but it's a moving target guys we stay with it every single day uh we reassess reevaluate and adjust accordingly that is how we do it at the crypto future all right so yeah looking good looking juicy guys like i said 63.5 um so I got a little uh, little something for you guys today. Let's have a look here at what we have going on. So Bitcoin's price will, uh, quote, will certainly be $1 million by 2030, which would be the top of the next bull run um, with surging trend. The CEO says, Raul Paul, uh, Real Vision CEO, described how crypto adoption rates put the Bitcoin price on pace to hit a nine-figure uh, number by the end of the decade so in the next bull run so let's have a look what he has to say guys are you in the michael saylor camp that bitcoin will most likely hit a million dollars yeah so how i back this out is two different ways one i just look at the log chart of bitcoin that trend you can extrapolate it and somewhere around 2030 it'll be a million dollars that sounds as ridiculous today as it did when I first bought it at $200 and I put a price projection of $100,000. Uh, I said it's actually going to a million, but I'm going to discount myself for being an idiot by 90%. So it cost $200. It could go to zero at that time, certainly, because that was 2013. But my price projection's 100000 And people said, this is ridiculous. I said, it's the best macro trade of all time. So the million dollars doesn't seem that preposterous. Um, the other way I back it out is when I look at the adoption of cryptocurrency. So you use as a proxy the number of active wallets. Now, we all know that's not a perfect proxy because people have multiple wallets. But you compare that to IP addresses for the Internet. Start them at both 5 million. Now, people have multiple IP addresses as well. So it's very similar. It's just directionally gives you an idea. Crypto is growing at twice the speed of the Internet in terms of adoption. So it's the fastest adoption of any technology in any asset class the world has ever seen. So if we just assume that growth slows, as it did with the Internet, because once you get bigger and bigger numbers, it's hard to grow at such a rate. So it goes from, let's say, 175 percent a year where it's been trending and goes to 43 percent a year, which is what the Internet did from year eight onwards. Well, crypto gets to a billion people by the end of next year a billion active wallets, and it gets to 4 billion by 2030. Well, at 4 billion, the price will certainly be a million dollars. So it kind of backs out from the adoption of the technology and of the log chart, because the log chart basically is the adoption of the technology. Very, very interesting, guys. What do you guys think? Listen, we have some factors you have to consider. For one, I mean... Again, we've talked about tech dev. Tech dev figures we're going to have about $140,000 Bitcoin by the end of July, beginning of August of this year. Uh, Plan B thinks we're going to see a $300,000 Bitcoin before the end of 2025 uh, peak bull run blow off top. So if you take those factors into consideration, those calculations into consideration, uh, then that would be on pace for about a million dollar BTC by 2029-2030. Uh, what do I think? Well, I think yes. I think it is most definitely possible to see a one million dollar Bitcoin by the peak of 2029-2030 bull run, uh, in my opinion. Uh, with the adoption spreading wildly, ETFs being approved all over the globe, competition, the supply and demand crunch that's going to happen, banks are starting to want to uh, custodial uh, rights and stuff like that. I definitely think that it is entirely possible 
And I have said for a while now on the channel, guys, that yes, I do think at some point, at some point, we will see a $1 million Bitcoin. Um, it is coming, in my opinion, absolutely. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Do you guys think we'll see a $1 million Bitcoin by the peak of the next bull run? Do you agree with Rao Paul, uh, Tech Dev, and uh, Plan B? Or do you think that, no, we're not going to see it? Let me know what you guys think down below. Hit the like, hit the subscribe button, guys. Click the join button to become a member of the channel. Supports the channel. You get members-only live streams on Sundays. We look at micro-cap gems, help with your portfolio structure, exit strategies, profit-taking. Follow me on X. Join the Discord. Like and subscribe. I will see you guys in the next one.